is up guys Madden Mobo Elite back with another video and today I'm going to be showing you guys the very best coin making method in the brand new Madden that will hopefully bring you guys tons and tons of coins to be able to get a really good team similar to the one I have right now I've been using the heck out of the method I have and I was able to get this close to 90 overall team just in about a week so um here as you can see I even have some of the legends that are brand new uh, not brand new, but, you know, they came out when the game came out. So, um, I'm very proud of my team so far, and it's all thanks to this method I'm about to share with you guys. So, um, very simple method, but yet it's sort of a risky method. Only use it if you have more than, I'd say, 300,000 coins. Um, so here we go. Basically, you gotta invest a lot to get a lot. So how it works. You basically buy a ton of pro packs, and when I say a ton, it depends how much coins you have. Like for me, I have about 800,000 right now, so maybe I'd say, let me spend about 200,000 worth of coins on pro packs. Okay, so I did that. I spent all those coins on pro packs, and then what do I do? I have all these players I have no idea what to do with, and they're basically just, they're just there's just a ton of players basically. So now here, what here's what we gotta do to make yourself some nice profit. You gotta come over to the set section. Go over to the upgrades area, and then these three, oh, no, not, the, not those three, but these three sets that I'm moving right here are the sets that are going to make you all the cash you need. So what you're going to do, you're going to come over to this set, and you're going to put in all the bronze, every single bronze player you have down in here from those packs, you're going to put in. So every single bronze player, um, up until when you can't do it anymore, you would get in, put them in, and then you would claim your two trophies just like that. I got two silvers, for example. And then once you do all of those bronze players, you move on to the silvers. Pretty simple setup so far. Easy to follow, easy to do. So then once you do all of those silvers, uh, pretty easy right there. Claim your six trophies. Now, of course, you would be doing that over and over again simply because you opened many pro packs. I just opened a couple in order to get enough for these sets. And then you want to come over to this set right here. And this is the big one, guys, the 10 trophy pack where you get most of your gold and elite trophies. What you have to do is... Any gold player you have that is below 80 overall, you stick in this set. So anything below 80, you stick right in this set and you use it for the 10 trophy pack. Anything that is above 80 overall, you, in my opinion, should sell because you'll get more profit that way. Any player above 80 overall generally goes for more than 5,000 coins, which, in my opinion, is definitely worth it to sell rather than waste in the set. Like this Sammy Watkins right here, this card that I'm moving around. He will most likely sell for around 12000 so definitely not worth it to put in the set. So now, you turned all of these players into trophies, and you're again, you're thinking, now what do I do with all these trophies? Now basically, you have one of two options. You can move over and just go over to the auction house and sell them, probably make about what you had before. Wouldn't be that bad, wouldn't be too good either. But what I've been doing to make all the coins I have is come over to this large quick sell right here, and as you can see in the top right corner, I have completed this set 234 times. Now, of those 234 times, I've gotten the 500,000 twice, uh, I've gotten six 250,000s, and I've even gotten 11 100,000s. So that is a ton of coins, and that is how I got my really good team. Um, I don't have enough to do a large quick sell right now, but this is where the risk comes into play, because many times you will get 1,000 out of this large quick sell, but then again, many times you get something big. So, basically, the more you play, the more you win uh, in that regard. So, basically, the more money you dump into this method, the more you'll get out of it, which is how I made all my coins and got my good team. Um, big thing to, to worry about, though, don't overspend on pro packs. Like, if I say I'm going to open 200,000 worth of pro packs... I should not go over that point, and I should not get basically addicted to opening the packs. Not really addicted, but to the point where I just want to keep opening more to see what I can get. That's not good, because at that point, you might lose money just because you're opening so many packs. It's good to open a lot of packs for this method, but not so many that you're throwing yourself completely in the gutter with your coin level. So, don't do that. Um, but after that, generally, every single time I do this, I come out with a serious profit. I mean, it obviously works, because obviously I have the team I do, so uh, as you can see, it worked for me. Um, it, I might just be a really lucky person, but um, I don't know. I'm just sharing my information with you guys. Let me down. Let me know in the comment section below if it works for you guys or not. Um, that'd be cool if it does. If not, I'm, I apologize. Like I said, I'm just ex uh, basically just sharing my methods with you guys. Uh, that's what this channel is all about. So um, that's going to be all for today's video, guys. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see all of you guys in the next one. Peace out. See you later.